So in this video, we're gonna be putting on the new AccuView Oasis with transitions so that you can see my first impressions of this new contact lens. So let's take a look. Hey everybody, this is Dr. Allen here from Dr. Eye Health, the channel that helps you with the eyes, vision, and finding the best vision products. So if you're new here, consider subscribing. Also, at any point throughout the video, check out the show notes and links below for further information about everything that we mentioned today. Now I'm gonna be putting on the new AccuView Oasis with transition lens. It comes out on April 1st here in 2019. So currently these are not those lenses. These are my other contact lenses that I usually wear, but I'm about to head into the clinic so that we can actually put them on for the first time and you can see exactly what they're all about. So here's the AccuView Oasis. It's just in the blister pack. It's an 8.4 base curve, a 14.0 diameter, and it's in my prescription of minus 550. Now, if we actually pulled it up over here in the light, this is just light coming through the door. I will turn it around, and just in the blister pack alone, we should start to see it start to actually transition into a gray lens. Yeah, you can kind of see it starting already. Now, the company actually says that it'll change within 60 seconds when when the lens is sitting on the eye and really exposed to UV light. And so that actually causes some crystals embedded within the lens to start to kind of change shape and block out the sunlight. Look how dark that's getting already. That's that's pretty impressive. And so this is just in room temperature in the blister pack. Yeah, wow. Look how dark that is. All right, so I took out my other contact lenses and I opened up the cases. So here we go. I'm gonna put them in for my first experience. Okay, so first lens is in, you know, just kind of comparing right and left, you know, I can't really tell much of a difference because this eye is so blurry, but it looks like the lenses do have just a little bit of tint to them just to start off. Uh, you know, the actual manufacturer state that it blocks somewhere between 14 to 15% of light just while they're clear. So just here, putting them in for the first time, they actually seem pretty good. I mean, they're clear, uh, they're comfortable. They're in my prescription, so they should be working. Uh, everything looks good. So yeah, now let's head outside. Uh, it may take a second for the camera to adjust, but now it's uh, kind of mid-March here in Minnesota, so it's all snowy and a little bit cold, but so again, my body temperature should help keep the lenses change really fast. And uh, I don't know, can you guys see it change already? I mean, vision wise, I'm pretty light sensitive from the snow, like snow blindness, but this already looks pretty darn good. Um, geez. Well, I don't feel as light sensitive as I usually am, so they must be changing. I can't, I can't personally really recognize that they're changing while they're on my eye, but I don't know. Um, let's actually stand so I get some daylight into the eyes there. So I'm not looking directly into the sun, but just the regular light bouncing off all the snow and everything around me. Is it already getting pretty dark, guys? I don't, I can't really see. I can't see in the camera. So let's now kind of compare here. So just out of curiosity of how my vision is gonna actually improve or not, I'm gonna just kind of slide the lens out of place. Oh yeah, that's a difference. That's a difference for sure. Wow. Yeah, that, that's just like kind of like wearing sunglasses and not wearing sunglasses. That is really intense. Yeah, I, I'm liking it already. Okay, so now we're gonna head back inside now. Uh, again, the AccuView Oasis and Transitions companies, all the research they've done, they say that it does take about 90 seconds, less than 90 seconds to turn back clear again once you head inside. So I'll have you guys help keep count for me here, okay? So we're gonna head inside. Okay. So again, the camera's gonna kind of adjust here. And whoa. So hopefully I don't look too creepy, right? Um, that is a little bit creepy because I usually have blue eyes and it kind of looks like I have gray brown eyes, but that's pretty neat. So I'm trying not to stand directly in the, in the light so it slowly starts changing back. 
This is pretty cool. Again, the lenses are really comfortable. I mean, they're the standard AccuView Oasis lenses that have been out for a long time. So uh, if you're someone who's never worn AccuView Oasis lenses, uh, they're a two-week lens, so you do have to clean them and take care of them. I'm usually wearing daily lenses, but hopefully if this technology takes off, uh, they'll eventually come out with daily versions of it. But I know right now and then I'll grab it's feeling really cool. Here. Can you guys see it? Is my, is my color changing back yet already? Kind of zoom in a little bit here. Can you guys see? So I don't know if it's really changed fully back to clear within 90 seconds, but I know my vision-wise coming in doesn't has not seemed kind of too dark or anything. It's not like I'm wearing my dark sunglasses or anything like that, but I can still see very clearly. So I think it's pretty awesome. Just as a first first round here. Okay, so now I just took off that other lens. I now just have the one my blue eye without the lenses and this one with the lens. So let's kind of step back outside and get kind of the full effect here. So, oh. Yeah, just kind of going back and forth. I can already tell things are a little bit way dimmer here with the lens, the lens, you know, the eye with the lens in it compared to the how bright it is with the other eye. Wow. So, I don't know, does it look really creepy comparing the right versus left with the lens and without? I don't know, you guys will have to let me know. So that was a pretty cool first impression with these sort of lenses. Uh, again, this is the first time this technology's ever been out. I know they've been working on it for over 10 years. The first lens, uh, actually, they, they kind of failed a couple of times. It took them almost three tries now to actually get these set up right. Uh, I'm just gonna head back here into the contact lens suite we have. And now, these lenses are, are, again a two-week lens so you do have to use some sort of solution to clean them with uh, the same company the AccuView brand made by Johnson & Johnson they also have the blink revital lens solution so perhaps it'll work better with this but I do have uh, a whole other video on contact lens solutions for contact lenses and if you haven't checked out that video I'll hook that up here in the YouTube carp above as well as in the description below but yeah for my first time wearing these lenses what, what do you guys think go ahead and comment in the section below let me know your first uh, kind of impressions from watching this video with these lenses. Are you excited to try them out? Uh, please comment again, I'd love to hear from you guys. All right, everybody, thanks so much for watching me unbox and try these new contact lenses for the first time. If you liked the video, go ahead and hit that like button for me, subscribe if you're new, and share this video with any friends or family or anybody who wears contact lenses or you know is occasionally bothered by bright lights. Otherwise, if you'd like to catch other cool videos from Dr. Eye Health, just click or tap the screen up over here to the side or go ahead and click or tap the screen down over here. Otherwise, again, this is Dr. Joe Allen here from Dr. Eye Health, the channel that helps you with the eyes, vision, and finding the best vision products. Keep an eye on it. We'll talk to you soon.